Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Mike Toledo. Got another cool tutorial to talk about. I'm actually going to give you the first chapter for free, especially if you are watching from YouTube, Vimeo, or something like that. Uh, I think you'll really find it interesting. It is one of the most challenging tanks I have done to date. Uh, not because of access. Access was actually quite great, actually, to be honest with you. Um, I would say the crease was tough. It was very, very deep, very sharp, hard to get your tooltip uh, on there, and a lot of tapping down and a ton of cleanup. So we are going to, or I'm just going to show you how I did it step by step. Now, not completely in this video, but if you're a Dent Trainer member already, you're in luck. You get to watch the whole thing, break down, a lot of great tips on there. You get to see me struggle and how I actually was starting to fight through it and get to that dent and, and how well I got it out. And um, it came out really clean. So I think you'll you'll definitely appreciate it. I think you'll find yourself getting a little lost in this in this video. Not necessarily confused, but really sucked in because I think there's a lot of good information in it and uh, I made it interesting as I always try to do and hopefully if you're a PDR tech and you can really relate to this and if you're thinking about doing motorcycle uh, gas tanks uh, this might be a very helpful video for yourself so let's get right into it let me give you some stuff to take a look at check out how it went and again, if you are interested or if you want to see the rest of this video, please sign up for denttrainer.com. You'll love it. There's tons of videos on there uh, between John Hiley and myself that do a lot of great tutorials on there. And there's something for everybody. So thanks for watching. Subscribe to Dent Time if you can. And also Dent Trainer on YouTube. And we will catch you on the next one. See ya. All right, guys. So I got Andy over there, my student right there. And he's going away on, on a nice deep crease. But meanwhile, he's doing his homework over there. And then I'm going to explain about the gas tank, what I'm doing now. This is a pretty good size crease, deep crease. Luckily, I got good access underneath. The fuel opening is, wasn't going to allow me to have any leverage. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of look at the board differently than I normally do for creases. And I'm going to show you, explain that. So I have it kind of like a lightning bolt look. Um, that's, that's how I can look at a deeper crease. Sometimes just looking at it straight on with the crease going in one direction, uh, like, like following the line to the direction of the crease, sometimes it's hard to read if it's very, very deep. So I'll turn the board where I get a, more of a, like a, a, a lightning bolt look. And that's what I'm doing right here. Now this is gonna be a full tutorial, but just explaining what I did. And, um, and how I attacked it. And then I was actually having Andy on there uh, do, do the dent as well. So um, check it out, follow along. I'll explain a little bit as we go. Okay, so I got this heated up and it's pretty much, it's, it's a little tight right here on this edge right here, but you know, I think we're gonna, we'll be pretty good on, on, on that type of, uh, of that push. So as long as you have the heat up, it's good, pull it back. I'm actually using a uh, big soft tip and I actually took a kind of a blunt tip and I put some leather over it to really give me a good push. Now it's gonna be a little slippery in there as I'm pushing, let me just get in here. I got a nice opening underneath and let me just get a nice push here. So I'm trying to work it against the grain a little bit with my body line, but it's, it's pretty tough. There we go. Some good pushes here. Ah! It's a nice good. I'm just like down here is the crown right here. Okay, we got a crown down this area right underneath, and we've got a heavy nasty some low, I mean, some pinches right in this area right here. So, but if you turn the board this way, it doesn't look that bad, okay? So, <clears throat> but we're still gonna tap down right on the bottom. Just, just to loosen that up a little bit.
Yeah. Well, my objective with the game is here is, is to try to pinpoint a lot of this out with this tip, okay? This is gonna help clean up a lot of this. This is very tedious, but it definitely, it works, it does the job, okay?